G'day YouTube, it's Marty from Music Video Muster. Today I want to talk about why I still collect music DVDs in the age of streaming. Welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe if you haven't already done so. So today I want to talk about the reasons why I still collect music DVDs. You know, DVD is somewhat of an obsolete medium. There aren't really a lot of record companies and music labels releasing DVDs anymore. So what's the point of buying them? Well, in this video I want to outline five good reasons why I still collect music DVDs and maybe why you should too. Okay, so reason number one is the physicality of DVDs. Now other collectors talk about this too. It's one thing to be able to watch the content that you love on YouTube or on a streaming service, but it's a different experience altogether when you're able to hold the physical disc in your hands when you're able to take the disc out, take out the little booklet uh, and look at the artwork, read the information that you don't get when you just watch a video online. So I really love the physicality of owning this kind of medium. And another thing is I just like to display my music collection. I know that there are some people who are trying to actively and consciously cut down on the amount of physical stuff that they have on their shelves, in their houses and so on. But for me, I like looking at this. My neighbour had a huge book collection. He was into this particular genre and he had bookshelves full of these amazing books. Recently. He got rid of all his books, I think he gave them away. He got rid of his bookshelves and he's going for the minimalist approach because he's already got electronic versions of those books on his Kindle, which is fine. I understand that, especially if you travel around a lot, you can't be moving a huge collection with you all the time. But on the other hand, that's what I really love about physical media and DVDs, you can put it on your shelf and you can enjoy just looking at it. Reason number two is that when you buy a DVDs or any physical media for that matter, they often contain content which is not available online. So for example, I love the commentary that you sometimes get on DVDs where the band will talk about how they wrote the song, how they filmed the video clip. For me, that's a huge value add, which is really gives a lot of extra insight into the song and helps you to understand and appreciate the music more. And sometimes there's some interactive stuff on the disc as well. For instance, with this Gorillaz DVD, there's actually some flash games that you can play. So I think that's a really cool feature. And obviously you're not able to do this just by watching things on the internet. Which brings me to my next point about interaction. You see, the way that you interact with the DVD or Blu-ray is different from the way that you interact with similar content online. With the DVD, there are no ads, there are no recommendations, there are no other distractions. You put the disc in and you can play it and you can sit down and enjoy that disc from start to finish as it was intended. Or you can skip the tracks, you can select your own tracks, but all within the parameters of that disc. And for me, I think that's a much more enjoyable way to interact with the content. So the next reason why I like collecting physical media is it's just a really fun way to shop. It's active. You don't just, you know, go to the shop, have a look around and buy something that catches your eye. Well, you can do that, 
but because music DVDs are mostly obsolete, mostly out of print, there is a bit of a process to find and to buy those discs. Sometimes a lot of research is involved and as I'm researching the discs that I want to buy, I discover so many other releases that I didn't know about, even if those releases are much older. So it's a constant learning process and it's a really active and fun way to try and find the content that you like. My final reason why I love collecting DVDs is it's relatively cheap. So the other points that I've mentioned up until now, they apply to other forms of physical media as well, such as CDs and vinyls. Well, for me, DVDs are much more affordable than vinyls are. There's been a huge resurgence in the popularity of vinyls in recent years. And it's a really great hobby, I think, collecting vinyl. But for me, it just wasn't a viable thing to do. Then what about CDs? CDs are kind of cheap, right? Yeah, they are. But for me, the reason I don't like to collect CDs is I wouldn't know where to stop. I mean, there are no clear parameters. There are so many bands, so many groups and artists that I love to listen to. And I think that if I decided I was going to collect CDs, it would be never ending. It's kind of the same with DVDs as well, but because they are relatively limited in their production, it's easier for me to focus in on the things that I really like. And so for me, I'm okay to stream music and I'm okay streaming movies, but music videos, DVDs and Blu-rays give that extra level of value, the visual element. And that's something that I really value and that I really enjoy. So that's where I want to focus my collecting efforts. Okay guys, so that's it from me today. I just wanted to make that quick video about the reasons why I still enjoy watching and collecting music DVDs. But now I wanna hear from you. Do you collect physical media? What do you collect? And why do you do it? Let me know in the comments. So I'll see you in the next video. Until then, I want you to make sure that you put aside some time this week to enjoy watching your music and I'll see you next time.